Hi everyone and welcome to codingzest.com. Guys, if you want to run your C or C++ program on your favorite code editor Visual Studio Code, so you are in the right place. In this video, I will show you how you can correctly run C or C++ program on VS Code. And in the last of this video, I will also run two sample program as an example to show you guys. So let's get started. First of all, we will need a compiler. So we will uh, download mingw. So simply open this link or you can find this link in the uh, description below. And from the right side, click on this direct download link, this one for Windows 10. Okay. So click on this and it will download the mingw compiler. So I have already downloaded it. And after the download is complete, simply click on double click on this and remove this address still this c just simply lift this c and forward slash and click on extract let me minimize this and it will extract uh, our main gw to our c folder and after this uh, extraction is complete we will set the path for this okay guys so the extraction is complete and now we will go to our c drive so click on c and uh, here as you can see main, main gw go to bin and copy this path and uh, here come to this pc or we can minimize this right click on this pc go to properties okay uh, we need to open this we will click uh, right click here properties and as you can see here click on advanced system setting click on environment variables and here click on this path click on edit and uh, add new and paste it path here click on ok 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 and close this now we will open the vs code if you don't know how to install or download vs code so you can uh, watch my video uh, you will find link in the description below so i will just simply open this vs code I will simply close this will open okay so from here go to this extensions and first we need to install a code runner extension so simply type code runner and select the first one and click on install okay on trust for space and install and if I scroll down here so you can see here okay let me scroll down from here you can see here uh, to run the code use shortcut control plus alt plus n and to stop the running the codes uh, shortcut is control plus alt plus m okay so it is installed and now we will install C forward slash C plus plus and install the first one Okay, click on this and I think it is already installed if you if uh, this is not installed in your VS code so you can install it from here uh, I think it should be this one so all these packages uh, are installed okay so uh, in your VS code if uh, this C or C++ is not installed so you simply click on install okay so I will just close it and now we will create a new text file from here so click on file new text file and I will save it on my desktop and you can save it on whatever location you want I will name it sample one dot C++ so don't forget to add this C++ uh, extension CPP okay click on save and I will write a sample code here okay so as you can see here this is our sample one and now uh, to use the shortcut simply uh, press control plus R plus N so it will run our program and below here you can see the results subscribe to coding this so we are uh, we are outputting this okay and also you can run this program for from this uh, debug or play button okay now we will create another text file and I will save it on also on desktop and I will name it sample2 dot cpp i will save it and now i will write code here okay so now we will click on this play button and uh, we will select this 
first one okay so it's just debug our program and we we need to run our program so run code okay simply click on this letter arrow and run code and uh, what is the error output simple to permission denied Let me okay so click on this settings open settings and search for run run in terminal and scroll a little bit down here so as you can see here code runner simply uh, check this box run in terminal and close this setting we will stop this program and what we will do we will run it again by control plus r plus n okay so now we will enter first name coding zest and as you can see here our program is running and working well so that's it guys and that's how you can run c or c plus program in visual studio code so if you like this video please share this video with your friends and also make sure you are subscribed to my channel and the bell notification option is on so you won't miss the upcoming videos